Hey, what's up guys? Steve here. Welcome back to another box break. This is the August My Junk Wax box. This one is a Michael Jordan themed one. It's always fun. Looks like all his classic uh, 1989, 90, and 91 Fleer. Those are the three main packs. Can't believe how expensive uh, 89, especially 90 Fleer boxes have gotten. But this will be good. 89. Got the 90. And threw in the 91 in this box. And we've got, looks like three football packs. Oh wow, okay, Pro Set Platinum. Don't run into that every day. You know there is a couple really good inserts you can pull. There was only a few they had in this set, but uh, if I remember right, there's a serial numbered uh, Emmett Smith out of like 550 or 650 or something like that. But that's a, that's a super short print for the Junk Wax era. Oh nice, and if you guys know my channel, this is one of my favorite Junk Wax era sets. Of course, can pull the first year of the Pro Visions. I believe I pulled the Bo Jackson last football season on the channel. And then it looks like a 90 Series 2. Um, what is 90 Series? Oh, yeah. So that's got a bunch of subsets that weren't in Series 1, but it's also got the. I believe the Bill Romanowski rookie that I still haven't hit on the channel. I was trying to hit last year. And three baseball packs also this month. This is the August month. A uh, box. I cannot tell what that is. It's got the puzzle piece on the front. I want to say this is 88. It's hard to tell through the package, but I want to say that's a blue back. It's probably 88. Nice. 91 Fleer Ultra. That is the first year of uh, Ultra for baseball. I have not opened that in a while. And then this one really caught my eye. 91 Opeachy Premier. I have a box of 92 sitting up on my shelf I still need to open. But always some high quality cards there. So let's see with football season kicking off here in a couple weeks. Can't wait. And the word of Bart Scott. Start with some football. All right. Cards are a little not sticking, but they just don't want to come off. Randall Cunningham. There we go. And that is card 605, so that's a series two card he had. Interesting. That's a nice one I'll put aside. Oh, right behind it. The Crunch Crew subset. If I remember right, they split up. There's a few Crunch, Crunch Crew cards in Series 1 and then a few more in Series 2. That is the Derek Thomas. Randall Cunningham again. Look at his hot guns. This is a hot pack for Cunningham. Cedric Jones. Kicker card. Jeff George. Webster and... No Bill Romanowski. So that wasn't a bad... If I got that pack as a kid, I'd be pretty damn happy. <laughs> Alright, let's... This one's gonna bother me, so we gotta do the Don Russ baseball. I'm pretty sure this is 88. I mean, I recognize the 89 set right away, but... Oh, yep, it is 88. Alright. I'm trying to think, who are the big rookies in 88? I know there's uh, Matt Williams, Caminetti... I can't remember off the top of my head. I know there's a few more. Not a big year though for rookie cards for baseball. Jim Rice. Andre Dawson. There we go. Looks like that is the hit of our pack. Diamond Kings. I think I mentioned in the last break. But uh, man, it was just so hard to hit the card you wanted in the baseball sets in the 80s and early 90s. Just because 
Well, at least the 80s, because they didn't have different series, so it was like literally 800 cards in the set sometimes, and you're trying to hit the one rookie you want in a single pack. I think we'll do the 91 flare. We'll work backwards. I don't know. This has always been a love-or-hate set, I think, for most people, the design-wise. Got J.R. Reed kicking things off. Thompson, All-Star Game. There's Jordan. Unforgettable. Well, not one of the Jordans advertised, but we at least hit one. Put that back there. Be nice to hit one of his... Uh, base cards. There's Parrish. Oh, there's a Carl Malone All-Star card. Very nice. I was going to say, oh, and then a human highlight film right behind him. Dominique Wilkins. Yeah, this is a pretty stacked pack so far. Hopefully we can have this type of luck in the 89 or 90 pack. But I was saying, um, I have not hit Jordan's base card in this set. In a long time. There's Chris Mullen. There's Ferry, Buck Williams, and McKee. Yeah, that was a pretty good pack overall. Can't complain on that one. Alright. We're gonna go with a 91 Ultra. I don't know, I was never a fan of the let's see, we got a brewer sticker. Never a fan of the 91 Ultra, but I really loved the designs from like 93 through 95. I think the quality really went up at that point. Let's go to Ultra Prospects. Bip Roberts. No way. Ah, oh, it's Senior. Ken Griffey Senior. I saw the name before the picture. <laughs> it's Kevin Mitchell, solid player for the Giants. Sedano. I was going to say, he's really young in that picture. So, not much going on in that pack. All right, let's go for one of those provisions. I love the provisions, but man, this was, I don't know. I always thought this was just such an ugly set. Thought they did such a better job on the 90 set. Lorenzo White, Mickenberg. Oh, we got one, I think. Oh, it's an all pro. Damn, I thought there was a Pro Visions at first, but those are more of like a black border. Vincent Brown, Rodrick Thomas, and Jerry Ball. All right, let's go with our second basketball pack, the classic 90. All right. Orlando Blackman. Damn, he's having a hard time rotating these cards because the back one's all sticky with the gum. Or the wax, excuse me. Sherman Douglas. There's Daughtry. Clyde Drexler. Nice Hall of Famer. Put that one aside. Cooper, Armstrong, Tom Chambers. Bird. Oh, the bird. Got the D. Reynolds hiding on the back. Well, if we're not going to hit a Jordan, that's a pretty good one. Very clean card, too. It was the second to last one, so no wax standing on the back. That's always good. 
solid hit though on the bird. Put that one up in the back. Well, no Jordan magic, but the bird will definitely do. All right, three packs left, one of each sport. We'll do the 91 OPG Premier. 91 goes, um, I don't think Chipper Jones had an OPG Premier rookie. I know the 92 set actually didn't have any rookies, so the 91 might not either. I believe they just took like stars, star players. That's a pretty good one, Dave Winfield, when he was uh, on the Angels at this point. Very clean cards. Pretty high quality for their time. Delino, Delino to Shields, Kevin Mitchell. I think that's the same photo we just saw in one of the other baseball packs. Dave Parker. Well, that's all you got with seven, seven cards in the, those packs of premium. Or premiere, excuse me. All right, let's do this one. This one's an interesting one. I want to see if they have the pack odds. Nope, no uh, pool rates on this, but I'm pretty sure there's there's one insert subset on here, and then there's I can't remember who the other player was, but I remember one of them was Emmett Smith, and it was serial numbered, I believe, out of 650. All right, let's see here. Pro set platinum. I can't remember the name of that uh, the insert sets, but it was it was something platinum game breakers or something. I should probably look this up before I start breaking boxes. <laughs> I'm pretty sure the random inserts were called something like that, but it had it was full of stars. I remember football is the hardest sport. Chris Spielman, that. Oh, well, I recognize that one. I was about to say to recognize a player. That is Junior Seau. Wow. Love that card. That's got to be one of my favorite hits of this box. For uh, any of you guys that are newer to my channel, that didn't watch any of my box breaks last football season, I am uh, I grew up in San Diego, so I was a huge San Diego Chargers fan until they moved. Is that McMahon? That is. Jim McMahon. Played for the Eagles. Man, he really bounced around later in his career. Jim McMahon. See, like this, I could not... I think that's... That looks like Dion, but I don't think that's Dion covering him. Wendell Davis. Yeah, you could really stump me if you don't put the names on him. It's for these older guys. Whoops. There's a PSA 4, Randall Hill, I should know this one, oh nope, never mind, not who I was thinking, quarterback for the Jets, there's another guy, Mo Gardner's, Mark Collins, interesting, I don't think any of those were the parallels though, I would assume they'd have to have some type of different look, but I... Like I said, I think they were called Platinum Game Breakers or something. I'm going to have to look up the checklist when I'm done breaking, but nope. I think those were all base cards. Alright, so one pack left. The 89 Fleer. Star player on the back. Oh! And our sticker is Hakeem Olajuwon. Man, the centering are... The centering's always jacked up on these stickers. Still, that's not bad. I mean, I guess you get one sticker per pack, I believe. Put that one up. Alright, let's see if we can get a Jordan here. Danny Manning. Old Cavs logos. There's Reggie. Wow, 
Wow, that's a really clean looking card. A little off center, but really impressed. This uh, the last two boxes I've owned, I've opened of uh, my junk wax box. They've been really clean uh, cards. So hit or miss with junk wax era. Oh, there's Pippin right behind him. I don't know if you guys saw it first, but it was pretty solid back to back. Got a Reggie and a Scotty Pippin. Got the all-star card with Dominique and Carl Malone. Or excuse me, all-star game. I, I don't remember too many of these in this set. Alright, Eric Floyd, Spud, Gold Spud Web. Daryl Griffin. Oh, Dennis Rodman. Damn, I was I knew we only had a couple cards left and I was looking for a red card for a Jordan. But that was a pretty good one to get if you're not gonna get the Jordan. Dennis Rodman. Very nice card. I think I only have one stand left. So, I mean, overall, if you're looking in the background, I, this has definitely been a stack basketball packs compared to, like, baseball and football. And then Adrian Dentley to end things off, so... I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. I thought this was a pretty solid box compared to the... Just in comparison to the Bo Jackson one I just did, but... I can't complain. Got the Rodman. Did get the Jordan. Technically did get a Jordan out of Fleer. We got the 91 All-Star game. Of course, got the Bird, Junior Seau, and Hakeem Olajuwon for our All-Star sticker. All right, guys. Appreciate everyone that joined me today. We'll see you guys all in the next video. Peace.